Coming up on Sports Weekly, we will take you out to San Bernardino High School for the start of the Alexander Madison I Am Gifted Football and Life Skills Camp with the yeah, Athletes for Life you know, Foundation. That. There that. is Look Alex. We'll have some action from there. And also, how about you the University of Redlands? We'll head out there to Ted Runner Stadium with the summer camp series going on. In fact, we'll check out the Bulldogs and some of the visiting Division I teams in town, including Boise State. We will hear from Boise State head coach Andy Avalos, who is an Inland Empire guy. And we celebrate and honor another local league champion here in the city of San Bernardino. That would be the Indian Springs boys and girls track and field teams winning back-to-back -back Mountain Valley League titles this year. We will have had head coach Lun San joining us here on Sports Weekly on IEMG. And it starts right now. What is up, everybody? Welcome to Sports Weekly on IEMG. I am your host, Pep Fernandez. We appreciate you tuning in each and every week here. And the best way to stay up to date on our latest segments on Sports Weekly is to subscribe to the IE Media Group YouTube channel. All right, here we go into the summer months. We are building up to the high school football season. But right now in the month of June, there's a lot of great local camps. And uh, the one we want to focus our attention to on this segment is the Alexander Madison I Am Gifted Camp. It started on Friday at San Bernardino High School, his old stomping grounds, and then Cal State San Bernardino on Saturday and Sunday. So a three-day camp talking football and life skills. So a very big deal to not only coach them up on the gridiron, but also give them uh, some great tips and tools to use in real life as well. And of course, Alexander Madison, one of our favorite guys, the former San Bernardino High School star, now a running back with the Minnesota Vikings. So let's check out some of the sights and the sounds, and we will have an interview with Alexander Madison here right now on Sports Weekly. <laughs> Oh yeah, most most definitely. It's one of those things. It's just like, you know, I'm back on my stomping grounds. I'm back where where I, where I came from, and I'm able to have all these kids look up to me and a smile on their face. I had a kid come up to me and tell me, you know, I didn't think I would have this much fun. I thought it would be fun, but I didn't know it would be this fun. And that just touched my heart. And just to be able to kind of do this for these kids, put it on for them, it's completely free. So they don't have to, you know, uh, parents don't have to worry about anything. They don't have to worry about anything. They come out here let their gifts shine and have fun. And it's amazing just to be able to come back and do it in my hometown. Well, this is what it's all about. It's really never going to be about the guys. It's always going to be about the kids. And as long as we got guys that care about these kids, like his AD and his coaches, you know, Alexander's a perfect example of what you can do and what you can get from this community. And we're just trying to let people see that, you know, you got a gift. Let's believe in that gift and dream big. One other thing, Greg, so it's beyond football. It's life right. skills as well. Right. Why is that important to have both? Uh, because that's really what they're going to do. None of these guys are going to probably ever make the National Football League. I told Alex and, and Kenny and all those guys, when they were in this program, none of them are going to make it. But I don't have a problem of being wrong. It's a great thing when I can say I'm wrong. And that's the kind of wrong you want to be. You know, it's one of those things where uh, – Live your dreams out, but being realistic, the life is that you're going to be a good tax paying citizen and you got to get a college degree of many times, or you got to come up with some type of uh, skill that, that, that puts, puts you ahead of the curve to live in California. And, you know, that's what Athletes for Life has been doing now for over 32 years. We, you know, we've got ROP programs, we got after school programs. That's what I'm so happy that these kids are doing something positive with their life. But I love it. No, I'm having a great time. The kids are out here running around like last year. Uh, I love that Alex comes back for the kids. It's uh, it's awesome. It's awesome. I mean, this is what he do it for, you know. He want to get back to his community where he comes from, you know, and giving back. We didn't have this when we were in high school. 
You know, no one came back and gave this to us. So it's great. He's doing big things, and he's going to continue to do it. Well, what I love about Alex, though, so he's, he's doing big things. We all we all know that. But all of his friends and his, at, and his teammates that he played with, like Darion in high school, they're still his friends. You know what I mean? So that's the best thing probably about Alex is no matter where he goes, he always knows where he came from, and he always hangs out with who he came from. So it's very, very nice. You know, he still calls me Coach Mills, you know, and I still call him little Alex. It's, it's, it's nice. Very, very nice. We're going to work some, some angle cuts. you going straight to this one and back around. We're going here. Get around the car. Get around. Finish. Tag off your teammate. Yeah, it's because, you know, you say that. Say that. Look at yourself in the mirror and say, I'm gifted. You read my shirt, you see it. You say it in your head. I am gifted. It's a subliminal message to let yourself know that self-love, the words positive affirmation and positive mental health practices, everyone was born with the gift inside of them. We just have to find it, embrace it, and use it to shed some light into this world. And I just hope to be a little bit of light in that world for them. And hopefully they grow up to do the same for others. There we go. We're going to rotate. I am gifted on three. One, two, three. I, I am gifted. gifted. Let's go. Y'all here. Alexander Madison still doing big things here in the city of San Bernardino. Best of luck to him this upcoming NFL season with the Minnesota Vikings. When we come back here on Sports Weekly, we will head out to the University of Redlands. We will see the Oregon Ducks, the Boise State Broncos, and the University of San Diego all in town to see our local high school football players. We'll have that next here on Sports Weekly on IEMG.